This is Aviv and Jared from West Coast Shaving, and today we're going to talk to you about why even, why even use a shaving brush. Shaving brushes are awesome to collect. They are awesome to shave with, hence the name shaving brushes. (laughs) In addition, uh, I will tell you, uh, we're going to talk about some of the reasons why, like why makes a shave better. I think that's a good, good way to go with it. Yeah. Uh, and then there are some other there are other things right like just uh, enjoyment style preferences. We'll talk about that too. Um, why does it make a shave better? Why can't it make a shave better? Uh, it's it's uh, certainly has a, a potential when you're working the lather it has uh, the potential to really develop something much more slick, much thicker, more cushiony than any kind of uh, you know can gel cream that you're likely to find. Uh, You just end up with something much more uh, luxurious, much denser, and that's protection when you're applying that razor to your face. Uh, In addition, there are fibers that are especially good at exfoliating. So boar is an example of something that's really, really good for clearing away some dead skin. Ugly, but true. Uh, Another thing... It's part of the process is a big thing for me. Like you were saying, what shaving is the best way to shave? And, and to get that best shave, you need the excellent shave soap, but to create the lather, mm-hmm. you need the brush. It's, it's a part of the tool in the toolkit that's going to get you that next level shave. Yeah. Um, and, and it's worth pointing out here, you know, we have a range of, of brushes on this table here. Some of these brushes are synthetic, these two, some are badger. Um, there are a range of prices because the handles look different with more premium materials. Some of them are handmade, uh, you name it. And I think uh, every single one of these, whatever the price point, anywhere from you know eighteen dollars to a little over two hundred dollars, uh, can whip up an excellent, excellent lather. And uh, there's really not a wrong way to do it. We're just going to try to concentrate on some of the ways to optimize it and make it the most rewarding for you. Right. So I don't know if we covered everything, but to recap. No, we didn't. <laughs> we're saying shaving brushes are awesome. Why use them? Use them basically. It's part of the process. There's a sensory feel to it. Yeah. There's a, a big sensory feel, and um, we didn't talk about that too much yet. Uh, the, the brushes um, can hold heat. And uh, the, the effect of the kind of building lather and scrubbing and exfoliating and trapping some of that heat close to your face really for me is, is like a barbershop luxurious experience, uh, something that I'm never going to get just by applying uh, a cream to my face and, and shaving. Uh, so to the extent that interests you, definitely you're going to have a much better time going with the brush. Right. It's building the excellent lather. It's exfoliating your skin, getting rid of the dead skin cells and dirt if it's a little bit tougher of a brush. It's getting under your hair and lifting it to make the shave easier. Mm-hmm. Uh, so it's, it's, it's straining out your hairs or you're trying to get the lather under your hair so that it's the razor has an easier time cutting the hair. Right. Uh, do you remember that guy who um, volunteered? We were going to like put... A lot of extra dead skin on his face and then show like what happens with the cartridge razor versus the, the DE. Right, and we couldn't get the insurance to cover the Yeah, that was a shame. That would have been good. We really we wanted to drive this point home. <laughs> we can't afford it. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and depending on your taste, the, the handles are beautiful. The the yeah. sh- the brush can be something that reflects your aesthetic personality. That's right. That's right. Um, Here we, we have um, a classic uh, English Simpsons uh, and uh, this chubby style, it's called. Chubby style handle and chubby style knot. It's extra dense. Here we have a psychedelic West Coast shaving handle. Um, again, somewhat of a chubby style in terms of, of the build, the shape, um, but obviously the colors are really unique. Here we have a carbon fiber handmade by an artisan in Utah, handmade. Uh, carbon fiber brush with a poured resin um, on top. We've got we've got the mula. This is heavy rose gold. 
it's not actual gold, but this thing is, is quite a, uh, a good F to it. Um, and uh, obviously very different type of aesthetic, much more modern. And then of course you've got kind of the, the more uh, standard resin, which is just colorful. And you can see the different shapes here. They fit your hands differently. Um, even though it feels really weird to, to try to make this a, a point, the fact is certain handle shapes for me are more comfortable when I'm building a lather. Uh, I like this knot, I love this knot. I find this handhold for me to be not the most comfortable. I much prefer a shape like this, but you know, everyone has their own take on that. Some people love the chubby style. And so um, that's another variable that, again, seems so weird to have to think about that, but it's true. It's part of the reason people will experiment uh, with a couple of different brushes. Yep. So yep. that's why, <laughs> <laughs> that's why you should, that's why I use the shape brush. Yeah. Ha <laughs> <laughs>